Good morning, you guys, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So if I sound a little extra tired today, it's because I am. The time change just happened, so we lost an hour of sleep. So yeah, I'm extra tired today. But anyways, I'm going to be doing a what I eat in a day to nourish my body video. I haven't done that in a while, so yeah, and you guys really like the last one. Yeah, let's talk about breakfast. So the first thing that I had was my dandelion root tea. I drank that while doing um, my little Bible study that I do at Sean every morning. So I don't have a clip of that, but I'll pop it up on the screen. I did take a quick little picture, so just so that I can show you. But dandelion root tea is really, really good for your liver and kidney health. I actually have a whole, I don't have, but I listen to a podcast that I recommend everyone to listen to. It just dives deep into dandelion root tea and the benefits of it and how it supports your health. So I will have it linked down below. But yeah, here it is. I drank it all while we did our Bible study. And then let's talk about the actual food. So I'm going to talk about it in the order of the way I eat it. Yes, I do eat my food in a specific order. It's just good for blood sugar balance, which I did a whole video on that as well. But essentially, I take a few bites of my greens first. So this is zucchini and onion. Studies show that having greens first before anything else, it just helps with blood sugar balance so that you don't have a roller coaster ride of like blood sugar spikes throughout the day, which obviously is not good for your health. So I'll eat like half of my zucchini and onions and then I'll start eating my organic chicken sausage with the rest of the zucchini and onions. So this is by the brand Amy Lou, I think. Um, I got it from Costco and it's so freaking yummy. So then I'll eat the rest of the sausages and then sometimes I'll also take a few bites of my toast. So this is gluten-free toast. I have a light layer of ghee on that. Ghee is basically it's just clarified butter. So I have my carbs there to help with energy. And then however, the toast is typically bigger, but this is the last toast of the pack. So of course the last toast of the pack is the butt. And I typically don't like eating the butt ever since I was a little girl, but in this day and age, we cannot waste bread around here, especially gluten-free bread because it's so expensive. But, but, pun intended, we're going to eat the butt. And then the last thing that I eat is this little concoction that I made. And it might sound a little weird to some, but it is so yummy and it's very nourishing for your body. So I have some frozen organic blueberries with some chopped walnuts and pumpkin seeds and a drizzle of local honey. So how this benefits your health, very quick rundown. Um, the organic blueberries is obviously high in antioxidants. It's amazing for your health. And then the chopped walnuts is healthy fats, obviously. It's really good for your brain health, heart health. And then the pumpkin seeds is really good for um, hair health because it contains something called DHT blocker. I hope I'm saying that right. Basically it helps with the bad testosterone so that you helps with hair health. Okay, I'll put it up on the screen if you want to read more about it. But um, and also pumpkin seeds are actually known to help fight or prevent cancer, which my holistic doctor actually told me about. And I did a little bit more research about it. So that's my little healthy bold concoction oh and then the drizzle of local honey is just really good to have during the spring it helps with preventing like seasonal allergies so yeah that is my breakfast for today i'm gonna eat this today is monday i have lots to do mondays are typically my busiest days of just work cleaning grocery shopping errands so yeah Every morning, so after breakfast, I always make my electrolytes in my bottle for the day. I obviously drink more than just this, but I have my electrolytes. This is the Nectar Essential Daily Energy one. So I love the, ooh, it is not focusing. There we go. So this one has B12 in it, which I have noticed 
my energy is a hundred times better since taking this one specifically with the b12 and obviously b vitamins which i do take like biotin which is a b vitamin and b12 is really good for so many different aspects of your health but yeah i always drink this first thing after my breakfast throughout the day also what i forgot to mention is that little pitcher that i poured into this water is my reverse osmosis water i have this little system if you guys follow me on um instagram then you have like seen me talk about it before some of the stuff in our water is so horrible for our health um but obviously reverse osmosis water is literally dead water it has no micronutrients in it it has no minerals in it nothing so um, that's why it's very important to add it back into your water which i just did with my electrolytes then i take my supplements um which i need to restock actually but right now i'm taking beef liver i just added beef kidney and a probiotic which is seed and um, biotin which just helps with hair skin and nails and yeah i think that's it but yeah i do take a little bit supplements but most of the time i like to get my micronutrients from my food that i eat i'm finally showing my face for the day but i just deep cleaned our hole downstairs and now we're gonna go to costco i'm just getting our staples i'll still show you guys but yeah if you guys have been watching my channel for a while you already know what i'm getting but i'll still show it real quick Okay, very quick Costco haul. So first thing that we have is this kimchi. This kimchi is honestly one of the best kimchis that I've had. And that's saying a lot because I used to get the kimchi from my local oriental food store and this honestly beats it and it's at Costco. But kimchi is obviously really good for your gut health. Any type of fermented food is really good for your gut health. So love having this when we have some Asian meals then we have our breakfast sausages this is by the brand oh wait i already talked about this when i had breakfast so these are my breakfast sausages that i ate this morning and that we've been eating for a while so really good ingredients and super yummy then we have zucchini which is obviously for breakfast and then this is the sliced grass-fed beef sirloin that we like to have on hand because it is so freaking yummy but also so convenient to make it literally is it is pre-cooked and so you can eat it like cold with sandwiches or you can heat it up on the stove top and you can make so many meals with this but what we've been loving is having this with some white rice and kimchi and the clean ingredient nori that i have or seaweed if you guys don't know what that is but this is the brand that we get and their teriyaki one which obviously is our favorite because it's gone is our favorite so we have that but yeah that's our favorite combo meal that we've been having recently and then in here we have organic ground bison for meals onions to have for again breakfast and other meals um and then this i want to talk about this real quick because Almost every single person in this world is deficient in magnesium and there's so many different types of magnesium. So I do have some sort of magnesium in my daily foods and in the electrolytes that I do drink, but that is a different type of magnesium. This one is magnesium citrate. And so this brand specifically, I have been taking since high school and it's funny because um, my mom used to always give me the little packets in a water bottle before i would head off for school on days that i had like a big presentation to go up in front of the class because i'm such an introvert and i don't like public speaking so she would always put it in a bottle for me and i would drink it and maybe it was a placebo i don't know but 
this brand and this one specifically always like just calmed me and I would always just do my best at my presentation. So for a while, I actually stopped taking this brand because I saw on social media, oh, magnesium citrate is just for to have like healthy bowel movements, if you know what I mean. Um, but honestly, every magnesium is gonna affect every person differently. And this has just been my go-to since I was in high school, which was a while ago. So I'm just gonna go back to this brand and see how it works to help with my sleep quality because yeah, time change, you know, I would need to get back on a good sleep schedule, so. We're gonna try that out tonight. And yeah, that is it for my Costco haul. I have to put all of this away and then we're gonna have a snack because I'm starving. And it was really hard grocery shopping when I was starving, to be honest, but. <laughs> Okay, it's snack time finally. So I have my protein shake. This is by the brand Aura. If you guys have been following me for a while, then you know that this is the only brand that I swear by and take. Sean loves it as well, obviously, but this is their plant protein. Two scoops has 22 grams of protein and amazing clean ingredients. All of their products has amazing ingredients. But what I love about their protein shake specifically is that it has not only protein, but a superfood and greens blend and an enzyme blend which is really good for digestion so definitely swear by this brand and then we have raw carrots and hummus so the raw carrots i know i keep saying swear but i swear by the raw carrots more specifically for well for my body at least for period cramps I have noticed ever since i started consuming more raw carrots i literally Feel like i don't even notice that i'm having my period i know tmi but i have no cramps no breakouts nothing um obviously i do other stuff to help my that time of the month but raw carrots i swear by it and i think there is there was a whole study or research done behind raw carrots and hormonal balance by this doctor i'll put it up on the screen and down below but then we have hummus because I need something with raw carrots. So this is the brand Ithaca. Again, very clean ingredients, super yummy. And then grapes. And I heard somewhere, I don't know, don't quote me, but the darker the grapes, the healthier they are for you. So yeah, don't quote me, I'm not sure, but I like darker grapes anyways. So that is my snack. I'm gonna eat this and then I have lots of laundry to do and I gotta edit this video. I hope you guys cannot see me in the reflection of this fork because I'm currently doing a deep conditioning hair mask and I have one of those like clear plastic caps on my head right now. That's why I'm not showing my face, but I literally look like a lunch lady. So since we're on the topic of lunch, here's my lunch. Um, we have just turkey, teriyaki, stir fry with mixed veggies. I get the organic frozen mixed veggie mix from Costco. I cannot recommend that enough because it's so convenient to just literally throw it in soups or stir fries. And it's obviously good for your health because it has so many different veggies, which is micronutrients. But yeah, turkey, stir fry, and then white rice. And kimchi, of course, which I already talked about the health benefits of that. But this is my lunch. And I don't think I've ever talked about this before, but I typically like to have a big breakfast, a big, semi-big lunch, and then like a little bit smaller dinner. I just personally feel that helps with digestion for me and just feeling just good when I go to bed and not feeling so stuffed and like 
bloated. So that is why my lunch and breakfast looks really big. And then for dinner, I just eat a little bit smaller than my other meals and another thing that i do want to quickly highlight is that i don't know if you guys can tell but i do have lots of organic frozen fruits and veggies on hand at all times so i know right now in today's society everything is so freaking expensive and i know other health influencers you know say fresh is best and i get that and it, it can be true but you know, frozen veggies and fruits are honestly just as good, especially if you get the organic ones and you honestly get way more for the price. I just wanna, you know, encourage you that it's okay to have frozen fruits and veggies. Don't feel like you can't be healthy if you don't eat always fresh foods and fruits and veggies and stuff. So anyways, I know that was a tangent. I'm gonna eat this and then I'm currently watching um, this is us and i'm on season two pretty good so far So this is what I made for dinner. My mom actually got me a whole bunch of these mixes, gluten-free mixes from this company called Mom's Place. And I was super excited to try it because look at the ingredients. If it focus, there it goes. Really amazing ingredients and it smells so yummy, but she got me a whole bunch. Um, I think one of them was like a gluten-free sourdough starter, um, pretzel mix, bread mix so many different mixes that are all gluten-free so if you're gluten-free i definitely recommend um this company so this is what i made i used ground bison and then we're gonna have some salad with it and yeah okay so i forgot to properly end the video because i took that calm magnesium and it knocked me out you guys so i obviously recommend it but for dessert after dinner we had some more grapes and then this little bitty unreal dark chocolate bar i love this brand clean ingredients and they instantly satisfy your sweet tooth so that is it for today's video i hope this video inspired or empowered you in some way and i will see you or talk to you in my next video bye guys